Hey guys, today I'm going to be doing a review of the MF8 and Diane 4x4, or Diane and MF8 4x4. I guess it doesn't matter, but it sounds better, Diane and MF8 4x4. Um, so, the two cubes companies teamed up to make a 4x4, um, and yeah, uh, I've done... I did it in my unboxing. It's taken me a while to do this just because I haven't had time. Um, so, anyway, if you can see right there, underneath the sticker is their logo. It has Diane, and in the middle of the circle is a plus sign, and it says MF8. Um, but, yeah. Uh, when I first got it out of the box, it was, it was pretty bad. Um, and I didn't really like it because it was locked up. It... Um, just was really really slow and I let it sit for a while which didn't do anything I don't think and then I lubed it with Lubix I took it apart lubed it with Lubix and then put it back together <coughs> and now it's pretty good um, let me grab my oh, Maru okay so size comparison it is just a little bit it's just a little bit bigger on two sides than the, um, so if you can see that, um, do it this way. It's just a little bit taller and you can, and a little bit bigger here, here this side wider than the uh, Maru. So, um, turning quality, um, outsides, outside layers are amazing. They are, as you can see, really good. Um, I like the outside layer. Inside, not as good, kind of stiff and slow and gummy I think a little bit gummy um, I don't know if that's the way I lubed it the way it is or what um, compared to my Maru see how fast that is that's why I like the Maru um, that's one thing I like about the Maru at least <coughs> it uh, yeah it's very smooth here but this is kind of slow um, and yeah. oh well um this this is really fast and really easy especially when you get to the three by three part um and all you have to do is solve the three by it's really fast um insides aren't as fast they're not bad though um i don't think they slow me down all that much um i got my uh pb personal best on this cube of um 258.95, two, 2 minutes, 58 seconds, and 95 milliseconds, um, and, yeah, uh, I haven't been practicing 4x4 much, but when I do, yeah, um, but I, here's, uh, trying to figure out what I'm trying to say, um, there we go, let me take these out, um, so, Oh, jeez. Sorry, guys. So this is the core. Come on, focus. There. So it, it is a ball core. Um, and so what I did to oh crap, um, lube it was I come on. I like it. I put like I took it all apart except for these center four on each side because I tried taking them apart and it just, I don't know, it started to fall apart and I didn't want it to fall apart and me not be able to get it back together. Um, I probably could have gotten it back together but I didn't feel like applying that much effort. Um, so, um, yeah, I put like a dot of, a little tiny dot of lube here and here and then here. I think, or, like, one, like, 
like you're lubing a 3x3 three three with Lubix where you put 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, but I did it on each side. Um, and then I put the cube back together. Um, Like so. And then I turn these here, and I put like a dot of loop here and here, and then here and here. Something like that. And then I just worked it in. Um, it made it better than it was, but it's still the inside turning is not great. I haven't tried loosening it because, again, I don't want to take apart these four pieces because they just. I think they end up uh, falling apart. There's a lot of pieces, so um, yeah, uh, you have to sticker it all yourself. It comes assembled, um, but you have to sticker it yourself, which kind of sucks. Um, but four by four is not that bad. Not as bad as six by six, which I had to do too. Um, I was replacing my stickers. Some of the stickers have started to peel, chip. Let's see, can you see that? Come on, camera. Oh my god. Okay, well, uh, hopefully you can see that. I don't know if it's focusing or not. Um, this one chipped off. Come on. There, that one chipped off. Um, they starting to peel a little bit. Oh, there was one other that... <coughs> uh, of course, I can't find it. Oh well. Um, so yeah, I think I'm going to get a half bright set from Cubesmith sometime and then re-sticker it. Um, but for now, these are fine. Um, I like the way the cube feels. I like the turning. Uh, corner cutting is not off so that's one full cube it doesn't do it you go a little bit less and it does um so yeah not bad and i don't know what else i can say about it um i like the cube and i would recommend it so comment rate and subscribe and i'll see you guys later thanks for watching